Hello everyone, welcome back to Pokemon Gold, and Dana just called me. Are you awake? Do you want a battle? I'm going to win this time. Oh, for God's sakes, even though I could easily get to you by just taking the monorail, but... Anyway, I'm in Red's house. I mean, my house. He has an N64. I'm playing his N64. Now there's the big question. I thought N... N... Red... N... Wrong Pokemon game! Wrong generation. I thought Red was too busy Pokemon training. Like, did his mom just buy the N64 and then just set it in his room for when he comes back? Looks like it hasn't been used in a lot. Really? So his mom's been playing the N64, I guess? Whatever. This is where I'm starting my Kanto journey, because this is where you start in Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow. Hi, Mom. I'm not your mom. Yes, you are. Hi, Red's been away for a long time. He hasn't called either, so I have no idea where he is or what he's been doing. You should be a little more worried. They say that's no word that they say that no word is proof that he's doing fine, but I do worry about him. Well, duh, you're his mom. They have programs that aren't shown in Johto. No shit. I'm getting hurt or sick, but he's uh, he's doing what he wants to do. Yep, okay. Goodbye. What's that? Professor Oak wants to go see me? Okay, let's just skip the whole him dragging me to his frickin' uh, lab. Let's just skip right to- Hi, Oak! Ah, oh, Corman, it's good of you to come all this way to Kanto. What do you think of the trainers out here? Pretty tough, huh? Actually, I beat them all. All the ones that I fought were easy, ease, and I skipped the rest. Mm, you're not collecting Kanto gym badges? The gym leaders in Kanto are as tough as any you battled in Johto. I recommend that you challenge them. How is your Pokedex coming? Let's see. Not at all. I think it's the same as what you... 179 Pokemon seen! 23 Pokemon owned. Rating, you're getting good at this. Yeah. The same rating you gave me after I defeated the Elite Four. You're in the area. I hope you come visit again. Nope, not happening. Now that I've visited... Nothing here. You don't even have your Pokeballs. Where's the third one? You should have one left. There shouldn't be... Who'd you give the third one to? Like, I'm pretty sure it's canon that Red gets Charmander, Blue got Squirtle, so who got Bulbasaur? Huh! That's a good question. Hi. Don't tell anyone, but Professor Oak's Pokemon talk isn't a live broadcast. <gasps> Oak, you liar! I'm letting the whole world know. You're a fraud. Pokemon's pro the Professor's Pokemon talk radio program isn't aired here in Kanto. It's a shame. I'd like to hear it. Ha! Thanks to your work for Poke on the Pokedex, the Professor's research is coming along great. I haven't been doing much, but shouldn't the Pokedex already be done? Either way, one more house to visit. Blue's house. Is his sister still in here? Oh. Oh, wow. She actually has blue hair. Hi, my kid brother is the gym leader in Viridian City. But he goes out of town so often, it's, it causes problems for the trainer. No shit. Okay. She didn't give me a map this time, but I guess she's still living there. Like... Uh, I suppose. Anyway, look, we're starting. We're on our way. We're starting our Pokemon League. We're starting our Kanto League journey. Sure, because the Pokemon, wild Pokemon around here are pathetically weak. I might as well take down all you trainers. You. You're the one who got Bulbasaur. No doubt about it. It has to be. I mean, you have an Ivysaur, so I'm guessing you got, uh, Bulbasaur. Unless you p pull out a frickin' ch uh, Charmeleon after this, or a Wartortle. Wartortle. I like that name, Wartortle. I'm sorry, but Wart- oh my god, ow. Well, you did increase your special little attack. But, as I was saying, War Turtle should, like, be, like, Mexican. 
What about you, Starmie? Um, no. Starmie, you... Starmie's a long way from any water. Well, there is some to the south in town, but... Kitten, can you ref can you fight back and use... No, I'm pulling you out. I need you to be happy. Ah, da, 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 da. Moonin. Moonin. Ah, Moonin is good for Starmies. You got the bubble beam? I would use Zap Cannon, but I'm afraid it'll miss. Zap Cannon hit the first time it shot, but... I'm going to Thunder Punch! You're also part psychic, so your defense should be incredibly low. Well, not incredibly, but rather low. Yay, I did it! No surprise. Down and out. You're strong. You obviously must have trained hard. Duh. I traveled all of, like, Johto. Let's see. Hi! I skipped you. If trainers meet, their first thing to do is battle. Uh-huh. That, uh... That's already been taught to me. Oh, okay. You're a new. You're a newbie. A newbie with level 31 Pokemon. Gotcha. And I know Shadow Ball. Heh, <laughs> You're screwed. What else you got? He's about to use Electabuzz. Yeah, we're switching out. Actually, no. Kitten, stay out. He looks like he's rocking it. Den pop. Yes, because Moon is taking some damage. Den pop. Den. <sighs> I'm sorry. Did you hit me? I didn't feel that. It's great that like. I'm used to doing Thunder Waves on Pokemon, especially Thunder types, but I think in the newer generations you can't paralyze Electric types. And every time I play the newer generations, it's one of the first things I do to everything, even Electric types. And then I'm like, oh yeah, you can't paralyze Electric types. Oh, so close. Ah, Swift. Well, that's probably all you've got. Waterfall. Okay, what else do you have? About to use Magmar. I'm pretty sure it's Denpop. Next to Kitten? Yeah, it's Denpop next to Kitten. Hello, Magmar. Still got those kissy lips, I see. You want to kiss me so much. So badly that you almost look like you're ready to cleanse your hand into a feast. Oh, so you smoke ring didn't work, so you're gonna use smog. That causes poison, doesn't it? Shit, it does. Dragon Breath. This really should not affect that much, but you're low on health, so you're dead. Woo. I beat you. Oh, I've got a losing record. For trainers, it's a given that we'll battle whenever we meet. Yep. Now, if you excuse me, I should have an antidote to give to Denpop. I mean, the Pokemon Center is just up ahead, and I'm probably going to be using the Pokemon Center, but pff, that antidote was in my pocket for the longest time. It was collecting cobwebs. Like, seriously, it's a, I wonder if that kind of thing has an expiration date. Hmm, an antidote expired three years ago. Let's use it! <laughs> Don't worry, you'll only feel to have diarrhea for a couple days. Yay, we made it to the Pokemon. I mean, we made it to Viridian City. Hi, nurse. We're plowing through our journey. Unfortunately, this is not the spot for the first gym leader. 
I know I probably teased you with Misty. Everyone is just like, you could just fight Misty and it's over! I heard that there are many items on the ground in Viridian Forest. Well, we're headed there. Um, there's the Mart. What else is here? Did anything else change? No, not much. That dude there. Who's in here? Oh, peoples. Not gonna talk to them, waste of time. Does this dude still teach me? Hey kid, I just had a double shot of espresso and I'm wired. I need someone to, to talk to someone, so you'll have to do. I might not look like much now, but I was an expert at catching Pokemon. Do you believe me? Yes. Good, good, yes. I was something out of the ordinary, let me tell you. <laughs> I wonder if I said no, he would, like, catch his Weedle. The Weedle he already caught. Nothing over here. I was half expecting there to be an item. Is there Mackies over here? I want to know if there's the Mackie. Is there anything over here? This seems suspicious. Whatever. Is there a Mankey over here? Yoo-hoo, Mankey. I like a catch a Mankey. Oh, it's a Rattata. Going around away. Too bad they couldn't let you, like, actually start over, but... I suppose they wanted you to plow through this part of the game rather quickly. And this is... Pokemon League. Victory Road Entrance. Really? I don't believe you. Oh my god, it is. Wow! This way leaves the Mount Silver. You'll see... Yeah, I'll need to go grab some more badges. Wow, that's kind of cool, because if I go down here, I end up in Johto. Or, well, pretty close to it. The route to Johto. But we're going to go this way. Enough dilly dallying. We need to at least get through Viridian Forest, which we probably won't. Because we have a bike, we're gonna zoom right through this. Zoom. I don't want to waste too much time doing this adventure. Howdy! My bug Pokemon are tough. Prepare to lose. Ah, oh, it's great to see nothing has changed. Bug trainers, bug catchers all over. With giant ass bees. Uh, no, if it, I'm, I'm pretty sure Beedrill has a low special defense. Wow, I was right on that one. Rage! Did dig all! Should have tried to bite. Oh well, I killed you anyway. And ding! Only reason I'm doing this is to level everyone up. They need to level up. Butterfree? Hecton. Yeah. I was trying to think on that one, but Hecton. I could have used Moonin. Because Butterfree is part flying. But we'll do Hecton. <laughs> oh shit. Gust works even when I'm flying. Oh, 20 damage. Oh, it hurts. I'm wounded. But you're dead. Wow, that was a lot of experience for that one shot. I was whipped. I'm going to look for stronger bug Pokemon. You do that. Um, Den Pop moves up. I think I'm going to end up having Kitten with me this whole, as an Eevee, this whole game. Why don't girls like bug Pokemon? I... I don't know, man. Actually, there may be some girls out there that like bug Pokemon. So, you just haven't found the right one. But with Pokemon like that... Trust me, I had one. Never a good idea. Unless this knows like super duper awesome moves now. Nope, he's paralyzed. Fury swipes. He missed. See what I mean? I kind of miss Sidek. Even though I could pull him out at any time, it's just Sidek was... He was special. Bug Pokemon squish like plush toys when you squeeze their bellies. I love how they feel. 
Um, dude, I don't think you want to be squishing bug Pokemon. <laughs> they squish under my boot. Oh, a dire hit. I'm gonna sell that. Wait, is this Viridian Forest? Is this what it's been reduced to? Seriously? Like, really, guys? Are you serious? You couldn't... Like... Oh, wow. You couldn't be bothered to, like, grow at the trees? <laughs> the trees shrunk! What was there, a huge fire here or something? And... Oh, I don't know. It's just the trees are all small and nobody's telling me why. Wow, we got through that pretty quick. Fight me! If you walk in tall grass wearing shorts, do you get nicks and cuts? I don't know, I don't think I'm wearing shorts. Am I? I think I am. Wait, is this character wearing shorts? You're wearing shorts! You should know the answer to that! Never mind, you're distracting me from this battle. Whole time I'm there. Does really? Does it? <laughs> Do you? I don't know. Am I wearing shorts? What made you think I was going to switch out? Bug catcher. Bug catcher is stupid. Zoom. Come on, what else you got? Bee drill. Oh, he's got bees. Let's try waterfall. Good thing we, you know, we, you could have had a triple battle, and if you only had was bee bee drills, then that would have been fine. The bee drill swarm. That's the one thing I really liked about um, the newer generation of games, like the more recent ones. They had. I mean, uh, the, uh, horde battles, where you can battle, like, five Pokemon in a row. That was cool. I hated the fact, I hated it when you only had, like, when you met the early hordes early on, and, excuse me, and you only had moves that targeted single targets, because you're like, oh, I didn't expect the horde to show up. <laughs> but, it's actually pretty cool. Especially when you knock them all out at once. They'll really sting when you take a bath. Now, you've got me curious. I am wearing shorts. They're pretty long shorts, but I am wearing shorts. I don't take a bath, kids. Yay, we made it to Pewter City. Hi. At night, Clefairy comes out to play at Mount Moon, but not every night. Sad face. Do I have enough? Oh, I might have enough time to face Brock. So let's not dilly dally. No, who cares about talking to people? Let's heal up and go challenge Brock. Let's actually get a freaking gym badge from Kanto. I'm gonna destroy him. Correction: Den Pop and Tamirinor are gonna destroy him. <laughs> this is gonna be easy. Let's do it. Dun, 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 dun. Actually, I think. The freaking yeah, the museum's still here. Cool. Wait, there is a notice here. Pewter Museum of Science is closed for renovations. Oh, well, it's still here, but I can't go in. I can't enter it. Okay, they're renovating. Do do do. Pewter City Pokemon Gym leader Brock, the rock solid Pokemon trainer. Let's go. Yeah. Peter City Pokemon Gym. Is it still the one guy? It's still the one guy. Wow. Misty definitely got greedy. Yo, champ in making! I am already a champ. You're really rocking. Are you battling the gym leaders of Kanto? They're strong and dedicated people, just like Johto's gym leaders. Yep, I'm doing it. Let's go. Den Pop, are you front? Yes. Den pop into Miranor. Let's go. Howdy! The trainers of this gym use rock type Pokemon. The rock type has high defense. Battles could end up going a long time. Are you ready for this? Except when you have, like, Tamiranor who knows Surf. 
Jerry! Oh, you don't have a Geodude like you used to. Jerry! What do you think you're doing? I'm gonna destroy you with Denpop. Okay, maybe not destroy you, but I'm gonna hurt you very badly. Uh, drink about. <laughs> Den pops like best move, Dragon Breath. Until she learns something new. Yay! Champ, or I was gonna say champion. Jerry was defeated. You're not a champion yet. I have to win these battles. Hey, you trainer from Johto. Brock is tough. He'll punish you if you don't take him seriously. Uh-huh. Sure. I am listening to everything you say. I am actually going to go up against Brock, even with Denpop wounded. But I'm going to save first, because that's what you do. Tamirnor is going to raise the wave on his rocky ass. Wow, it's not often that we get a challenger from Johto. I'm Brock, the pewter gym leader. I am an expert on rock-type Pokémon. My Pokémon are impervious to most physical attacks. You'll have a hard time inflicting any damage. Come on! Are you sure? Oh my god, this music. Hello, Brock. Oh my god, Brock. Where did you... Where did you get all those Pokémon? Doesn't matter, let's do this. Figured. <laughs> You're gonna be, like, battling a regular trainer. Because you're my level. And... Dead. Yep. What else you got? Kabutops. Oh! Great. I don't have... Shoot. Uh, I don't have a grass type. A grass type would be totally helpful here. Because Kabutops is rock and. water. So Kabutops is resistant to surf. I'm gonna try Moonin. Because it, Moonin's attack should be super effective. Because I'm pretty sure. it should be. Should be! Sup, Cannon! And you know surf. Why am I not. I should have. should have just stuck with Tamiranor. Ow. Oh, that wasn't bad. Stop cutting! Bam! Oh yeah! That's what I'm talking about. About to use Rhyhorn. Yep. This is where Tamiranor comes out and just murders. Moonin, you're going to be awesome against Misty. Let's just say that. I mean, you've never missed a Zap Cannon yet, even though I've only fired twice. Sploosh. I'm pretty sure Kabutops... Was Kabutops his best Pokemon? I would think it would be Onyx, but... I mean, his Geodude evolved into Graveler. But Kabutops was a higher level than anything I've seen so far. I was about to use Amistar. Ugh. <sighs> Moonin, can you do... Can you pull off another Zap Cannon? If you can, you would be awesome. Oh, Moonin! Bam! Ha! Oh, I thought it said that Zap Cannon wasn't that accurate. That's three for three. Yeah! Leader Brock is about to use Onyx. Figured he would save Onyx for last. Onyx. Yeah, Onyx is his best Pokemon. I, I knew he favored Onyx over Geodude. I knew it. But Onyx is still an Onyx. He's still rock, he's still water. Or still water. He's still rock, he's still ground. Tamiranor is still water. He still has the freaking. Well that item that boosts up water. I can't remember which one I gave him, but he's got a, something that boosts his water attacks. And he still has Surf, which is one of the power, most powerful water moves. So yeah, Onyx is dead. That was the easiest gym leader I've ever faced, I'm pretty sure. 
Your Pokémon's powerful attacks overcame my rock hard defense. He had to use that word. You're stronger than I expected. Go ahead, take this badge. Yay! I received the Boulder Badge! Woo! Corman, thanks. I enjoyed battling you, even though I am a bit upset. That Boulder Badge will make your Pokémon even more powerful. Do I... can I see it? No, I can't. There's nothing here. I can't actually see. I don't get... I don't get a Kanto. Is that in my key items now? Where's my Kanto? That sucks. Oh well. I'll just have to put something. I'll have to find something to put. Probably use the Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow Boulder Badge at the for the border around there. I'll put something down to show that I got it. Not that... Well, I'll remember because I'm following the route. So, we beat Brock. We got our first Kanto badge. Now, we are going to... On the next episode, we are going to head through Mount Moon, back to Cerulean City, and actually take on Misty. Whether that's all going to be in the next episode or not, I don't know. It depends on how quick it t I take to get through Mount Moon. But until then, I'll see you guys next level. Old man! Hi! Ah, you came all the way out here from Jono? That brings back memories. Oh crap, why did I talk to you? He would then flail around like a child and reveal the fact that he was sitting on his sunflower seed the whole time. Despite the fact that you told him to give up on the only thing he valued in life, he still calls you awesome and returns to the clubhouse with you. I mean, this is expensive, but come on, he could have done a little better than that. That's a nugget. I know, I've gotten one before. I can't give you any nuggets of wisdom, so that'll have to do. I'm leaving. You're useless to me. Here's a nugget of wisdom. Don't give any gold nuggets!